Senator Feinstein has highlighted in the case of Carol Lamb in San Diego uh, an email from Kyle Sampson to the White House Counsel's Office saying one day after she files indictments against Republican lawmakers, this is a paraphrase of his book, we need to do something about her now. Is that appropriate? Is that not political Again, interference? Again, I don't like Kyle Sampson refer to that. If you also take a look at emails in your possession, you'll find as early as January of 2005, there were expressed uh, concerns about Carol Lamb. But, but having said that, those are issues properly addressed to the Justice Department and to those responsible. Well, Tony, if I can just follow, because sure. this is, it's not good enough to say, well, Justice Department officials will be made available and so forth. This, you say, you say, put it in perspective. Part of that perspective is the question of independence, the judicial independence, uh, Justice Department's independence from the White House. And this is the White House Counsel's Office and the political advisor involved in conversations about attorneys, and in this case, but, a direct communication about we need to do something about her now. But again, you're referring to a Kyle Sampson memo. What I'm telling you is, I'm going to Kyle Sampson or others are going to have to answer the question what they meant by that because I don't know. We don't have a context for it. But what I can tell you, the implication in your question is that suddenly she becomes a concern on this this date, which I believe is in like May of 2006, something like that. Uh, the we have documents that, again, have been made public already that have people expressing concern about her in January of 2005. So.